What is up, guys? The next game I'm gonna bring you is uh, Reiku vs. Sabella, Sun and Moon OU. I'm also gonna try to cover Snow vs. Hector Hard mode later. The score for the Stark Sharks is 4 and 1 versus the Indie Scooters. I really hope the Indie Scooters can make a comeback. Reiku is the favorite to win this match, in my opinion, but I would love um, for Sabella to win this. I would love if Sabella could uh, prove me wrong and bring this back. But yeah, I will see you with the match. I've been talking for too long, right? 33 things already. So here we are, though, with the match finally, man. Sabella was taking forever, I don't know. Dude, this looks like an ISO team Sabella has. He just put a scissor over the... I have this team, it was... Um, I suppose it on the forum, it was AV Torn, Specs Hooper. Like, I assume he has a different team, but it just looks like that team. Uh, I think it's Calmind, and yeah, it was Calmind, Tabofini, Offensive, I think, Timid. Not sure about the trend, and the Lena was, I think Lena was Scarf, and it was Ferrothorn in, uh, scissor, in the scissor slot. It was Hazard Stack. Okay, let's analyze Reiku's team. What that, I think that's, uh, is that HP Ground Volcavona? Oh, he has Earthquake Venusaur, that's either HP Ground Volcavona or Earthquake Venusaur, in my opinion, to, to lure Heat Trend. Because he's kind of weak to Heatry, right? I guess he has... Nah, he's kind of weak to Heatry because Tabofidi could get blue boobed. Ah, he might be bad at Tar and Rocks Lander, but I think he's... Um, he could be... Uh, yeah, I think he's bad at Tar, actually. I'm not sure. Like, he could be uh, Scarf Lando and Rocks Tar, but I think Banta makes more sense. Hurricane, um... So he's life orb torn, he's not AV. That hurricane didn't do that much, but that's called also the 5. And yeah, that's nice to see him hit that hurricane. Hex turn 1 would be really bad. Um, I assume this Volcarona might not have Bug Boss. And uh, Tita might have pursued to trap Lattice. But it, it doesn't have to be pursued. But it might be, because like, Lattice are not even common at the moment. So Raikou doesn't have to be pursued. Let me see if Raikou struggled with Marowak. Nah, he doesn't struggle that much with Marowak. He has Feeny and Titar. And Lando to hit it hard. I don't think he needs Pursuit for, to hit Marowak either. Like, to switch, to trap it. God. <laughs> I'm messing up here. Okay, Raikou's taking his time, because... Um, Tabu Feeny was like his only uh, Hooper check. Like depending on the Hooper set, that's the only thing I could switch in on a Dark Puts. I guess Tita can also switch in on Dark Puts, but Tita gets destroyed if Hooper is... Okay, Sabella goes for U-turn. I don't know, he could have just... Nah, he probably predicted the Tita there, but... And he didn't want to take Sand Puts life up and get whittled down. Maybe he doesn't have super power if he U-turned. Because if he had, like... He could have just super powered Tita next turn after Hurricane. But then he would have been really low with Life Orb and Sand. So what's Sabella gonna do? Predict the Venusaur and go for Nature's Madness here? Or is he gonna um, just go for Moonblast in case Reiku stays in? Actually, I, I was talking the entire time it is either Rock's Lando or Rock's Tar. <laughs> it's probably Rock's Bronze, and I don't know why I didn't realize that. Would it be Trick Room? I don't think it's a Trick Room Bronze. I think it's just like... What's the, why would you use, use Bronze on over Jirachi? This actually looks like a team um, Trosco made. That Trosco used in a short on live. Okay, nice special attack drop. <laughs> Goes for Nature's Madness. Misses. Oh. My dude wants to call. Uh, call of Thieves. Okay, so Reiku misses at Nature's Madness, which obviously sucks. And uh, can you add uh, can you add Padlop to the call, or do I have to do that? Oh, I don't think Padlop is on at the moment. No, he just messaged. 
Okay, okay, cool. Yeah, I'd park lock too. Okay, um, should we call on Call of Thieves? I don't know how to add someone here. What, what, I'm not what, sure. what is the what would the bronze song set be? Stealth Rock, right? And uh, um, HP yeah. Eyes? Stealth Rock for like Toxic or something like that, I guess. Like, I think. Uh, oh, it could, it, could, it, it could also be EQ. Yeah. I was saying that earlier that the Venusaur is either Earthquake or the, or the Volcano's HP Ground. But yeah, EQ Bronze Song obviously an option. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's Trick Room on this team. Yeah, uh, yeah. Why would you use it bronze on? Like, like it can't be trick room because like everything is not that strong. Why would you use uh, bronze on over uh, Jirachi, just because of levitate or like what does it even do over Jirachi? Isn't Jirachi bulkier? To, like it checks a little bit better, doesn't it? Yeah, it and Jirachi support. also gets wish, which is like better. I'm not sure what bronze on really. Does? Bronzong doesn't get trapped by Dagi, I guess. That's the only difference. Yeah. Uh, so this is Bloom Doom. This is Bloom Doom trend. Yeah, this is definitely Bloom Doom trend. Oh, uh, or it could, uh, it could be like Power Hub. Uh, no, it can't be like really Power Hub because uh, Lando is the only rocker. Or uh, this could be Power Hub. And solar beam and stealth rocks and uh, the Z move is on Lando. I'm not really sure. Or um, like the EO game, uh, it could be like dual uh, Z move. Do you think thing. the the Tita is banded? I I thought the Tita uh, would be banded. I think the Tita is, yeah, probably banned. But uh, I. Th I think the, his Reiko team is like really slow and he needs some speed compensation. So probably oh, Lando is Scarf. Yeah. At, at the beginning I, th I was like messing up. I thought the um, Rocks Lando or Rocks Star, but then I realized a few minutes later obviously Rocks Bronzong. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Reiko kinda has to sack something. Um, oh, I think he's going for Magma Storm here. Yeah, because uh, Titar oh. is a safe play because uh, mm. uh, Magma uh, even because even Bloom Doom like does One, nothing yeah, in the sand the because uh, Solar Beam like gets. Uh, does Bloom Doom get weak in the sand? I'm not sure. Uh, it's, it's... I'm not sure too. I'll, let me just confirm. Yeah, but yeah, that that that, that miss sucked because with the magma storm damage plus the recoil, it might have killed. As he scouts for the bloom doom, never mind. He didn't go for bloom doom. Okay. So is this uh, rocks land? Or you said it would be Z move. Hmm. No, no, I think it's uh, pretty much pretty sure that's uh, rocks land. Wow, scarf land, I assume. Um, Lysergic is online. I just hope uh, Gemvet also comes online. That would be nice. <laughs> that would be really awesome, but I'm pretty sure Jam is going to just sub out. Yeah, it's HP Ice Bronze. Um, okay. Ah, oh, HP Ice. And he's just going to fire off another Magma Stone. Yeah. And if he's uh, a deaf, he might live a Magma Storm and go for. No, I don't know if Earthquake even kills. No, no. Bronzong has Earthquake. trash attack, I'm right? Not... Yeah. I'm gonna add Padlock for the next game, because I don't want to, like, have Skype in the recording too much. I already had Skype in for a few few seconds earlier. Yeah. Oh, okay, wow. Okay. Why did he not he attack? Actually, he got went for the Earthquake. Uh, he probably didn't attack, because I guess... But he's a Tita? Yeah, uh, I'm not sure why he didn't attack there because if the if the Hooper like, is like damage, what? even even getting off damage on Titar is like the Hooper kind of destroys Reiko if he yeah, especially if it's yeah, life if, or if he, if he like like I mean uh, 
Tom Finney is already damaged, so like if it's Baron Hoopa or even Specs, he could just click uh, Dark Pulse and or Hyperspace Fury and just destroy his team. So I would have preferred the damage on Titar, even if he switched out. And like if Bronzong stayed in, then uh, Magma could have like just destroyed him. Uh, yeah. I am not really sure about that choice by Reiku. Sorry, by Sevella. Reiku gets like completely destroyed by Zardua. Might be Scarfta. <laughs> it might be Scarfta. Yeah, probably. Or maybe it's Barantar and his uh, way of checking it is Focus Blast Miss. Sevella's just gonna SD a bullet punch. Okay, just U turn. Oh, he just U turns. The Phoenix Yeah, there's really no low. point. There's like no point in SD. Yeah, because there. there's a Volcarona on the back. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. And if he, if he would have SD'd and U turn next turn, he could have gotten Flame Body Burn. Yeah, that would have been really bad. Um, I don't know why uh, Sabella switched out his Tornadoes early. He okay. Uh, yeah, I think this is like this is like a play which. Whoa. Said, oh, okay. Whoa. Okay. Just go, why why uh, why did he go for the defog there? Um, defog ensures that he never gets up rocks. Uh, and but he gets healthy uh, healthier with lefties. He's gonna go for Bloom uh, eventually. And you think, okay, so you think it's Scarf Heatran and he's like sacking the top of Fini so that he can like pursue trap the Heatran and ensure no rocks for the rest of the game? Um, I, I, I was thinking it was Benatar earlier, but I'm not sure anymore. Like if the vocal, like, if the vocal like I don't, uh, I don't see a Z move mod, so uh, I'm not really sure. Oh, and Reku's like, team is, oh, Reku's obviously Z move for Corona. That's like he's either um Z Hurricane or Z um Inferno Overdrive. That fire move. That fire yeah, move is yeah. so strong. That's like an eighty three percent to to um guard at plus one. Oh, Reku was spamming Defog. Sabella catched on. Oh. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's yeah, kind of maybe, weird. Even if Magnus uh, kills I, now. Oh, he doesn't want to risk it. Uh, I'm like trying to analyze like why these players made these plays. <laughs> like, uh, Tapu Fini. If I think I, you, I think it's Scarf Titar because like once Tapu Fini goes down, then Scarf Titar like pursuit traps the Heatran or something. Or I don't think even pursuit kills if uh, Heatran stays in. Well, knockoff is gonna do a lot if he has knockoff. Yeah, that's true. Uh, knockoff is gonna do a lot. Okay, I, okay, he doesn't have knockoff, I guess. So, what is he gonna go into? He turned off scissor, scissor. What's the potential last move on? Uh, the torn superpower. Torn, yeah, it, it's probably uh, hurricane. No, if he was Heatwave, I'm sure he would have gone for it. So Hurricane, U-Turn, Taunt, and... Uh... Super Power? Is Reiko like... Reiko doesn't usually bring fat, so... Would he really need Taunt on uh, Tornadoes? Uh... Okay, I don't know. Um, I haven't seen too many Reiko replays, so I cannot... <laughs> give an opinion on that. I think he used offense versus Blender last year in finals. He had like a Crawdon. Yeah. Yeah, that game was like pretty awesome. He's just um, going to go to Volcarona here, right? Yeah, uh, I mean, like, Volcarona is a player, like, he should not U turn uh, because. Ooh. Yeah. Why yeah would that's, you that's, that? that's. That's. Yeah, that's so deserved. Like, why would you ever U turn there? <laughs> and JNP. Okay, that's. <laughs> Bob. that's that's not a defensive wall corona because like U-turn did a lot. Yeah, it's it's probably the Z move, Z -move one. Yeah. Um. 
What what would the other moves be? I don't think it has bug bus because he has a Tita to pursue the laddies. Oh. Oh, you uh, HP ground? It, uh, either HP ground or the Venusaur also has off quick. Now the Venusaur probably has knock off to get rid of yeah, lefties yeah. and trend. Well, what is, what is Volker Volker gonna like set up on? Uh, it sets up on type of Fini, I think. On Scissor. Uh, yeah, it sets up on Scissor. But once you get it, once uh, Volcarona like gets a quiver dance, it's pretty much game. He, he could have just doubled into Torn or into uh, Hooper that turn. Yeah. Actually, maybe not into Hooper because it might be Bug Buzz Volcarona. Uh, oh, he could have also like, doubled into Landry. Like if he was Scarf, like if he Scarf Hooper, then. Uh, that would have made sense, but uh, I don't think anyone except CDC that like runs uh, Scarf Hoopa, right? Nah, I don't think Scarf Hoopa is a set and... Um, like, okay. I, I saw I had posted a team in the forums uh, and it had five out of the same months. It has a, it had a Ferrothorn over Scizor. Uh, this team? Yeah, this team, and it, and it had Specs Hooper. And yeah, someone, someone, uh, Black, uh, Black Oblivion said this was Iza's team or something. Yeah, and it, but it had Assault Vest Torn. And yeah, this Torn is live up, so maybe Hooper is not Specs if Torn is the break of the team. Yeah, like he's. He might be Scarf yeah. Hooper because his team is kind of slow. But Scarf Hooper is not even that fast. Does it even outspeed stuff like Ash Greninja? Yeah, I think it speeds Ash Greninja by a few points. Uh, Reku is just gonna go into a. Uh, you think Venusaur this lander is a scarf? Or Lando? Because yeah, I think it's it's a scarf lander is because he has like even Sevella has like no speed control, so it's probably scarf. Yeah, so the Hooper is life up or specs then. Also, like uh. Non choice Lele just destroys Sabella's team uh, because his only counter is, uh, I mean, check is. Heatran gets focus uh, blasted. Heatran. Mm. Yeah, yeah, Heatran just gets focus blasted too, so. Um, it's like, no counters. Like, uh, Hoopa can also run Z Snatch, but that gives it. I think that gives Hoopa a speed boost. But, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure he's, like, not Z Snatch. He's probably Z uh, Bloom Doom with Z Solar Beam. But like NJMP was talking about that in Ricardo's video, that uh, a lot of people don't even know about. Oh, um, that's a huge crit. Yeah, that crit sucks. He probably had. Yeah, he probably HP had ground, ground or something to kill yeah. the Heatran. Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. But I guess, uh, like, uh, Sabella missed like two magma storms, so. Yeah, but that one was like deciding. Yeah. Uh, now we will find out if it's Bantar. Uh, I don't, I don't know. Like, yeah, yeah, we we will definitely find out like, if it's Car for Bant. What does Reiko do versus Fat with this team? I think it has to be Bantar. I honestly don't like Reiko's team. It's like passive. And it's Sun Moon, like passive teams don't work out really well. Yeah, that's Bandits, I think. I, I think, I think like, oh, Sabella should have stayed in with the Heatran. He stayed in. To be he, honest. He stayed in and it killed. Uh, that's Bandits. He stayed? Yeah, he stayed in. Okay, 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 fine, fine. He stayed in, so that's, that, that's definitely Scarf then. Is it Scarf? Yeah, oh, yeah that's the, Scarf. Like, the was fast. How do, like, how does the Teetar outspeed yeah, okay. Heatran? Yeah, it makes speed. Um, yeah, yeah I, that's, wasn't, that's I, wasn't I wasn't sure if Pursuit would kill if it stays in. Okay, so it's probably Zemo Landers. Team of Landers? What do you think? Uh, no, yeah. On, on Reiku's team or on Sabella's? No, no, on Reiku's team. No, Reiku was uh, on Sabella. Yeah, on Sabella's team, it's, uh, I'm sure it's uh, Scarf uh, Landers. No, I'm pretty sure Reiku, uh, the, the Volcarona was the Z-move man. Okay, so you think... Uh, Lander, uh, so Reiku is running Dual Scarf and uh, Tyranitar and oh. Landris. Okay, I didn't think about that. He could be Double Dance Lander, yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure anymore if it's Zemo for Corona. 
Um, the Volcarona could have been. What would the Volcarona be? Giga Drain, HP Ground, and Fiery uh, Fire Blast. Uh, I guess it was just the normal one, the Fire Blast, HP Ground, and Bug Bus one. Bug Bus or Giga Drain? Isn't Giga Drain good for the Tapu Fini? Oh yeah, yeah, Giga Drain over Bug Bus. Uh, Hanuki oh. Sex of the Fini here. Okay, not, okay. Yet, not yet. And what is he gonna go? Uh, Hooper or Torn? Like he just goes out with anything that kills the top of Fini. Um. Sabella so kinda has to win this game. His team is like 1 and 4. If they wanna have any chance of coming back. Okay. Uh. What does he does even it, have for this does it like Bronzo? Doesn't Tornado does like just destroy him right now? Yeah, if he can hit a hurricane on the Venusaur, that is. Uh, I think Regu is like has to go out into uh, Bronzo, unless like unless it is uh, Choice Scarf Landris. No, I don't think it's Scarf Landris. Uh, I think uh, Taunty, the last move of Taunty could be HP Ice. For Guard Chomp. Uh, but it, but it, uh, I don't think it makes sense because uh, the, isn't Heatran also running HP Ice? Heatran runs uh, Magma Storm, Solar Beam, and Earth Power and Taunt, I think. Uh, no, it's it's a Rocks trend, right? Yeah, okay, then it runs Rocks and Taunt or. Rocks and Earth Power, Solar Beam and yeah. Magma Storm. I yeah, so I think it's HP Ice Storm. That's why he switched out on the like uh, Bronze Zone because I don't see any other reason why he would switch out on the Bronze Zone, right? Like uh, Heat, if he had Heat Wave, he would have definitely gone for no it. Heat Wave, no knock off. What is the last move? HP Ice. Also, Super I don't think uh, Reiku's this thing. Uh, Reiku's. Uh, uh, Bronzong like uh, kills the Taunty from this range inset because uh, I don't think it has Gyro Ball. What do you think, Doc? It has HP Ice, Earthquake, Stealth Rock, and yeah, probably Gyro Ball or Explosion. No, 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 not nah. Explosion for sure. Okay, he goes on a T tar. So he's predicting it to not be. So he's predicting that it's not superpower. So uh, Raikou just loses if it's superpower, right? Yeah. Pretty much. Like, Raikou still has a shot if it's Dual Dance Lando, like he can just it set works. up on... The... Okay, it is superpower, alright, alright. Does he live U-turn now? Yeah, yeah, he definitely lives a U-turn. And then... He he lives another uh, super power too because of the attack drop. Yeah. Uh, Couldn't he have gone into Bronzong like hard into Bronzong? He didn't have to take that hit. Uh, no, he was just scouting for the super power. Yeah, but his Bronzong. Is I think lower. that's an all right play because like, if Taunty went for the U turn over there, uh, then uh, later on he could have trapped the. Taunty with the uh, Titar. So I guess that was a good play by Reiko. Wait, Taunty can. How can Titar trap Taunty? Uh, Pursuit. Yeah, but it just dies to If he didn't power. have the, if okay. he didn't have the superpower. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, he's going into Scissor yeah. Orlando. Oh, I guess he can now. He can go Fini. Yeah, Fini. Do I'm not sure if Sabella would want to defog. Uh. If he goes Fini, he can just attack. He doesn't have to defog. He can now just if he breaks the Venus, or he can now just madness. Or he can also just uh, like Moonblast or Scald. Now Scott, Moonblast doesn't kill Fer uh, Bronzong. Yeah, yeah, he has to go for the scout. Like, 
few months called not everything even to that. Alright, like I said again, I don't really like right Reiku's team. Like it's so passive and you know, Sun Moon is like not a passive gen. Yeah. He goes on a scissor on the gyro ball. I guess it's fine. Uh yeah. Uh, he's going. He's going for the U-turn here. U-turn doesn't kill, and he or can, he could set up an SD and go for the U-turn. No, no. I think you know. I think he's going for the U-turn here. You think he's going Venusaur in case he, uh, in case the scissor stays in. Oh. Uh. Like if he stays in with the bronze on, he's not really gonna do much. Just bronze on the setup. Yeah. And I'm not really set up for it because the scissors burned, but it's still just chilling there. He could use. The only thing that uh, Bronzong has over Jirachi is Earthquake to hit Heatran. Hmm. I really like that, that that he doesn't have a Jirachi in that slot. Jirachi could also like healing wish support the team. Uh, what did Draco go for? Yeah, I think he went for the gyro ball again. Okay, cool. This Phoenix only shot taunt yet. Oh, uh. that's definitely not calm mind. Yeah, on the team I had from Isa, it was calm mind, timid type of Fini. Yeah, this is Nature's Madness card, probably. I think he should go on a Venus right here. And get off the Mega Evolution. So Bella's just probably just going for a Skull if he has it. Or if, yeah. he, if he doesn't have it... Um, yeah, Moonblast doesn't kill it. Would he double into Torn? Okay, didn't double into Torn. Okay, okay, okay. Why did why did he do like why did, why would you like ever double out into like Scissor there? No idea. Oh, uh, I mean, he probably had doesn't have Scald. Mm, uh, he, he has Moonblast over Nature's Man. Oh, sorry, over Scald probably. Would he like sack the Scissor or would he? Yeah, he sacks the Scissor because yeah. I don't think he can risk the the Hooper on a potential knockoff. Yeah. Okay, he goes down in the taunty here. Uh, Venusaur lives one. I'm pretty sure. It, okay, okay, it's no, no, no. Uh, it does it because it's a life orb. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think. He's does he go for the miss? I think he's you turning. Does he go for the miss here? Like, see, if he goes into Tita, the turn gets really low because of sand and life orb. Yeah, he's going for the U turn here. He should click U turn here. Like. He might. Um. From Reiku and I have knockoff. I might click knockoff. Oh, Reiku has like twenty seconds left. Yeah. Okay, he sacks okay, the, the bronze on. He goes for the hurricane. Okay, okay, oh. okay, okay. The Bella was not playing around with the Venusaur. <coughs> the Venusaur is annoying. Like Venusaur is that bulky fat mon. I mean, nah. He also has Hooper to destroy the Venusaur. Never mind. I thought who? I thought Venusaur was like boring his cheek, but it's not. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna pivot, hard into like pivot into yeah Venusaur, he's gonna like Orlando yeah yeah he's gonna pivot into Venusaur. So Bella's just you turning if he predicts that. Yeah, and I think uh, like uh, but Sabella like really does not lose anything by just super powering. If it's helmet Landrus, it's probably not helmet, but it might. No, it's not helmet Landrus. It's better. definitely dual dance. Oh. oh, I think Bronzong is there to like check Metagross. Yeah, but Earthquake probably only does like 30%. Oh, nice crit. Okay. Now he's gonna go back to Titar. Probably on the Hurricane. I mean, he didn't no, go for he Hurricane. Goes out into oh, the, wow. He goes out in the taunty. Yeah, Isabella predicted him to go to switch there, but he didn't switch. Uh, 
Now just yeah, this is Upa. looking like this is like looking really rough for Reiko because of that single crit. Oh, you didn't go Hoopa. Yeah, uh, I think he's gonna go. Yeah, he's he has to like he's he's like has to hit the hurricane here. Yeah, but he has to hit the hurricane. Couldn't he have gone Hoopa and just if he specs, he could dark pulls. I think yeah, well, been, why? Okay, he goes the for the U-turn here. I don't yeah, I don't, turn. I don't understand that play either. Now he's going out into Hoopa. I mean, Sabella probably wins. But... Yeah. Uh, the only way, like, uh, Sabella is... No, the only way uh, Reiku is, like, winning is... Uh, uh, doesn't if If... If Sabella goes for the EQ here instead of the U turn. Yeah, and he goes Landris and sets up. Uh, yeah. That's the only way, only possible way I see of uh, Reiko winning right now. Reiko didn't play last week, I think. I don't remember. Or, oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, because of the poison, I think uh, Draco has a shorter winning this. Uh, but do you think uh, the only the only question is if Landris lives a life orb hurricane from uh, Taunty? After rocks, that's gonna be close. Oh, uh, that's probably a roll. Yeah, let me count this quick. Petlop just left Smog Tours because we didn't invite him to the call. He got mad. <laughs> just kidding. I'm not sure if he got mad, but he left. I typed uh, instead of Pokemon Calculator, I typed Petlop. <laughs> uh. Yeah, if Rake, if it's not HP Ice Torn and he sets up here with Landorus, this yeah, this, he can win now if it's not HP Ice Torn. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh yeah, it does, it does 70. Okay, never mind. It's HPS. It does 76 to 92. I have to call here. Someone posted yeah, it. Yeah, it's HPS. Okay. Yeah, that's game. Was the walker gonna quit like game deciding? I'm not sure. Yeah, it was game deciding because like it just a walker on like swept his team. And yeah, yeah, that crit like definitely turned the game around. Doesn't Hoopa live a plus one fire blast from Volcarona? No, it's in for the overdrive. Yeah, but you said it's double dance land, or? No, it, it can be like double Z move. Oh. Yeah, you cannot have two Z on moves. On the team. No, you can't have oh, Z, okay, uh, two okay, Z okay. moves. Oh, you mean use But you can you just want. use one, yeah. Yeah, I don't like that, but okay, that's an option. Um, yeah. Yeah, even I don't like that, but it's definitely an option. Like, you can have like two Megas on the team, but uh. Use only one. <laughs> yeah. Like uh, people, uh, like uh, in one of the teams I saw, uh, you use a like Mega Slowbro and like another Mega Mon. Uh, but even if you don't like Mega with the Slowbro and you Mega with the other Mon, the knockoff does like relatively lesser because it's holding a Mega item. Yeah, I I thought that um to counteract uh, Gothitelle and Aurith, uh, it was like Mega Slowbro, so you cannot get tricked. Also, I think or uh, here Reiku could have made another play. That is uh, going out into uh, T Tar. Which turn? Uh, the last turn. He could have gone out into T Tar. On the HPIs. Uh, on the pause. On the on the potential hurricane. And then uh, you think the Tom would have died to send? Uh, no. And then now. Uh, then then. To, uh, he Go has to like hard. No, he has to like hard. Uh, yeah, he has to like. If he wants to keep the Taunty alive, then he has to like hard into uh, either Lando or uh, Hoopa U. Uh, because uh, if he U turns, then the life up kills him. And if he like superpowers, then it was a 50 50 if he like went back into Landris. So. Yeah, I think uh, the last turn could have been a bit more different. I don't think it would made a difference in the end. Yeah. Isn't Hoopa like... Like, like on the HP Ice, if he went out into the T-Tar, 
uh, he got off an extra sand damage. He got off extra sand damage on the taunty, and uh, if yeah, he would he could have just sagged the uh, yeah he he sags the Lando. Uh, Oh, uh, no, no. He sacks the he sacks the uh, Cheetar, and if he's and if he's like Jolly Landris, he can still win. Yeah, but he gets intimidated by the opposing Lando, and I'm not sure if he. Yeah, but uh, then he if he if the Lando comes out, then he SDs on the Lando, and the opposing Lando like dies to the poison, and he yeah. possibly he possibly could have like EQ and uh, knocked out the Koopa you. I'm not sure when the next match is, but there are like I think 20 more matches. Um, but all yeah, this is the last. Yeah, this I have to like I'm out again for like one week. There are only I'll some like only some of the matches yeah. are interesting because yeah, uh, like I'm, X-ray versus the Trinity. Like I definitely am rooting for X-ray in that game. Flaming Victini versus TDK. Yeah, Flaming Victini versus TDK. Snow I was want Flaming Victini to win that game. Snow versus Hector Hard Mode. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm okay. gonna have to end yeah, this. A few good games. Yeah, I'm gonna end it okay. here because running is gonna take yeah. really long. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Gonna be back with more FPL soon. Uh, thanks BTB for being on the video. Bye guys. Yeah. Bye guys.